couldn't even believe that it all happened. It was so crazy. I woke up right before we hit. I was sleeping in the car, and I don't, I don't remember anything after the accident. I don't remember you or anything, but I just want to thank you for everything that you did. You're welcome. I'm really glad I can help you. I'm so proud you were there. So I wrote a letter introducing myself mm -hmm. and the day we met and how we met and I told her about me getting into the car the day of the accident and how I went in and I crawled in and I calmed her down and I sat with her and I calmed her down and then I crawled in and I took her babies out and then I checked up on them to make sure they were okay and then I went back in with her uh -huh. and I sat down by her side until paramedics came. All right, great. Well, when I had saw my car, I mean, I got off my car and then I, went, I ran to my aunt's car and I mean, it was shocking at first because I didn't realize what was going on until I went up to their car and I realized it was my aunt, my aunt's car and it kind of took me a while to process what was really going on mm -hmm. and so then I went to check up on my, on my cousins and I made sure they were all all right. And then that's when I saw Amanda's car, and I saw their car upside down in a ditch. And I mean, all I heard them, I could just hear screams from the car, and I knew I couldn't, I couldn't leave them in there. So that's when I ran to their side, and I had, you know, I pushed the window open, mm -hmm. and I moved the airbag, and I told her, I was like, I'm gonna get you out. I was like, don't worry. I was like, I'm gonna get you guys out. Mm -hmm. And that's when I helped out Mike from the car. And then, I mean, I'm little. So I was able to crawl through the window and sit mm -hmm. by Amanda's side. And that's when I helped them all out. Yeah. And and this was and you just kinda reacted. I or... mean I, I saw smoke, I saw the car, I smelt gas everywhere, but it was none of that was really going through my head. Like uh -huh. the first the only thing that was actually going through my head was I had to get them out and I couldn't leave them in there. Yeah. yeah. So my first reaction was to get them out. Not mm -hmm. even worrying if the car could have exploded or not. Mm -hmm. I just, I knew I had to get them out. Mm 